Perplexing Platinum, the mysterious metal. In today's video, I will give you three different coin dealers takes on Platinum, as well as that of yours truly. Stay tuned. T. Hello, Silver fans. This is T, and you're in the place to be for silver education, acquisition, and entertainment. And hey, before we get into it on this video, I thought I'd just take a moment to say thank you. I just hit 5K subs, 5,000 subscriptions, and uh, who, hey, who would have thunk it? Uh, not me, that's for sure. When I started out this little YouTube channel uh, over a year ago, uh, I never knew where it would wind up. And uh, so today I am uh, feeling very grateful to have passed that threshold uh, just a day or two ago. And so my sincere pledge to you is to continue providing quality content. Some say that I've been killing it lately uh, with all of my coin shop videos and some of the kindest words have come from fellow content creators. And it, I tell you what, it makes me feel uh, really great uh, to receive that uh, critical acclaim and feedback from those that I uh, really admire in the community. And so thank you for that. That being said, I make videos for the common man. Uh, you won't see me uh, throwing out uh, two grand a pop here and there. Uh, I just chip away and uh, keep adding to my stack little by little. And uh, that's one of the reasons you see me going all over God's green earth to coin shops. And I can tell you, uh, you subscribing is the highest compliment that I could receive. So this is just that little reminder that you receive in every video. Hey, take a look down here in the corner. Uh, you can see a, a little logo of mine that says subscribe. If you touch that, you'll subscribe. And or down, go down below and you hit that subscribe button with the little bell notification right next to it. That means you're showing me that you value my videos and, and that is encouragement to me to do more. It's like rocket fuel, man. I'm telling you, uh, the more people subscribe, the more motivated I am to keep on putting out great content. And I'm doing my best, guys. And even in today's video, I am challenging myself and using my creativity to, to, to do things that I'm not seeing other people doing. For example, uh, the format of this video, putting three coin shop owners all in one video, giving you their take on a particular topic, in this case, platinum. That's my way of trying to, uh, again, push the envelope of creativity. I am constantly trying to do new and innovative things. So, hey, enough of me talking. I'm going to get to the video in just a moment. Uh, but let me uh, give you one more little reminder to stay to the end. I'm going to show you my entire platinum stack. Hey, so without any further ado, I am going to hit the streets of Chicago and visit my buddy Russ over at Harlan J. Burke. Here we go. Now, here we are uh, getting ready to pull up on 31 North Clark Street, uh, the home of uh, the oldest coin shop in downtown Chicago. And I, I think you're going to enjoy Russ's take on platinum. In the previous video, he didn't touch on platinum. So this is all new. Enjoy. All right, Russ, I see you've got uh, quite a selection of platinum here. And I happen to, I happen to have a buddy who is really into platinum. His name is Pistol Packing Pilot. He has his own YouTube channel. Uh, tell me a bit about uh, platinum and your uh, thoughts on platinum. Yeah, so, I mean, platinum is one of those metals that, you know, it's gone through a bit of maybe an identity crisis. You know, I remember when platinum was twice the price of gold and, you know, platinum was a really hot thing. I mean, it's, it's the entire reason that if you, you know, look at American stuff, you'll see that the face value of, you know, uh, an American uh, platinum eagle is... is uh, is a hundred dollars where the face value of an American gold eagle is only a uh, fifty dollars. So it's kind of one of those things that it's had kind of its it's had its day. I'm not really sure where it's going to go. Um, you know, it had a lot of applications. It still does have a lot of applications for you know industrial uses. You know, that's why everybody's catalytic converter was always at risk. <laughs> um, but right now it's sitting at 
1067, you know, it's not quite, it's not quite half a palladium, um, which, you know, is in the same family, but, uh, I don't really have a prediction for it right now. Um, you know, I've, I've seen some speculation of like 11, 1150 by the end of the year, and I think that might be a, a pretty decent guess if I had to, if I had to put my reputation on it. You, you touched on platinum for just uh, a second there, mm -hmm. and uh, one of my good buddies on YouTube is named Pistol Packing Pilot. Okay. He's uh, really into platinum now. What's your take on platinum? Do you see a lot of potential there? If it wasn't for silver and where I think it could go, um, I like platinum just for the fact that platinum and palladium have switched their positions. And probably a matter of time before the automotive industry probably goes back to using platinum mm -hmm. for their catalytic converters. Uh, so, and I think it's being used in other uh, other areas as well. But I just I like platinum as well because I think it's undervalued. Mm -hmm. I don't care too much about palladium. Um, it's definitely seen higher prices. It's still more expensive than any the other three metals. Mm -hmm. I just prefer you know silver, platinum, gold, and that kind of order. Got it. Well, that's straight from the horse's mouth. Uh, you know, you've been in this for forever and uh you know maybe i need to start listening to pistol packing pilot a little bit more about this platinum thing to diversify so he's on to it so yeah. <laughs> uh, silver kid wants to know about platinum it seems like it's not really high on a lot of people's list of things to stack uh, what's your view on platinum uh, i mean it's down i mean platinum historically has always been you know almost double the price of gold for yeah. whatever the reason the last 10 years or so, platinum has come down, and there, it's just not rebounding for whatever the reason. I mean, now platinum's just now hitting a thousand dollars an ounce again. Yeah. So it's been it's been down forever for whatever the reason. It's just not a metal that people are all that interested in. The folks who are into platinum are just beating the drum uh, and saying, "Hey, everybody, wake up to platinum!" Yeah. And yeah, it's just not happening. No, yet. I do not have that client base. No, I very very rarely get asked for platinum. Okay, guys, hey, that was the take on platinum for three different coin dealers. And uh, so feel free to leave a comment. Let me know what you think, who was right, who was wrong, what good points were made, and how do you disagree or agree? Feel free to leave a comment below. Oh, and by the way, as promised, I mentioned I would show you my entire platinum stack. Well, are you ready for it? Here it is, right here. This is the entirety of my platinum stack. Uh, yeah, for me, uh, I still have stacking goals that involve uh, silver and gold, and uh, I'm going to continue working on those, uh, oops, there's the queen there, on those uh, goals. Uh, I will probably be mixing in a little platinum here and there, uh, but I've got a long way to go, guys. Now, before I end, I just one more little mention. If you are interested in becoming a channel member, uh, hey, that's a thing. And uh, if you didn't know about it, uh, for $2.99, which is less than a gallon of gas these days, and you guys know I travel around like a maniac going to all these coin shops, you can become a channel member. All you have to do is click on that link up there on the top right of the screen. Now, speaking of links, I've got three more links to uh, various videos that I think you might enjoy. Uh, at the top here, you can hit that uh, circle, my logo, that's my subscribe. And down here, I have two other videos that I think you might enjoy. Actually, this one's a video, this one's a playlist. Hey, thanks for watching, everybody. Two.